This week, we're talking about protecting sensitive data, choosing the right cloud architecture, and KubeCon 2019. I'm Stephanie, and welcome to This Week in Cloud, where we serve you the lowest latency news. Cloud data loss prevention is a powerful service that brought state-of-the-art data protection to a variety of workloads and storage formats. And now, it's even better with an easy-to-use UI, making those capabilities available to your security, compliance, and legal teams. Learn more about scanning your data, setting up regular monitoring, and identifying trends, no terminal required. Speaking of sensitive data, it's time to revisit best practices for password management. October is famous for being National Cybersecurity Awareness Month. While it can be fun to dress up as someone else for Halloween, it's a lot less fun when someone dresses up like your bank account. So in honor of the holiday, Google released two white papers discussing modern password security for users and for system designers. Happy holiday reading. One size fits most is not a policy we believe works for cloud solutions. That's why Google Cloud offers a variety of products in many configurations. If you find yourself caught between Compute Engine and Kubernetes Engine, you're not alone. We've created two architecture training paths so that you can learn more about virtual machines, containers, and make the best choice for you. And speaking of Kubernetes, KubeCon and CloudNativeCon 2019 is happening November 18th to the 21st in San Diego, California. If you want to learn more about cloud solutions of all sorts, you should come. Register online today or on site at the conference. If you want to read more about these announcements or see a full list, check out the link. Have any thoughts or ideas? Leave us a comment or tweet us. We'll see you in the cloud.